Okay, hello everyone, and today we're gonna be playing Half Life. I know this is a pretty old game. This game came out like maybe 11 years ago, kind of when Port the first Portal came out. But if you guys don't know, this game is in the same universe as Portal, and yeah, today we're gonna be, I'm gonna be playing it. And um, yeah, so I know this is a really old game, but yeah, I'm gonna be playing it today. So um, yeah, let's do this. And my guys, um, I'm gonna try to upload like every other day now. Not every single day. I'm gonna try to upload every other day on um, Sundays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. So basically every other day except for the weekends. But yeah, let's get into this. Uh, let's just do medium, I guess. Good morning, and welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. This automated train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47. Okay, and before we get any more into this, I'm completely blind to this game. I have never seen any gameplay. I, I sh uh, okay, I've seen like the first five minutes of it. A.M. Current topside temperature is... 93 degrees with an estimated high of what? Okay, cut off for some reason. This train is inbound from level three dormitories to sector C test labs and control facilities. If your intended destination is a high security area beyond Sector C, you will need to return to the Central Transit Hub in Area 9 and board a high security train. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. toxicity of material routinely handled oh. in the Black Mesa compound. No smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. Please keep your limbs inside the train at all times. Do not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to fix the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. this evening at 1900 hours in the level 3 facility. The semi-finals for high school workers in the European Do you have a friend or relative who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team? Immediate openings are available in the areas of materials handling Whoa. and low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other...
Ah, okay. A reminder to all Black Mesa personnel. Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing oh. a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds oh. for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Finally here. Now arriving at Sector C test labs and control facilities. Yes, finally. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. Okay, there we go. Oh my gosh, that's like portal holy crap. <laughs> Now this looks like Outlast. <laughs> hey Mr. Freeman, I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about 20 minutes ago and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were having some problems down in the test chamber too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Okay. Where is that at? Down there. Can we do this later? Okay. Okay, where is the hazard suit at? Oh, okay, I guess it's over here. No smoking. Hey, bud. What you doing? Excuse me, Gordon, but I'm rather busy now. Okay. Freeman, you'll just have to wait until after the test. <laughs> okay, then. Here we go, I think. So we're looking for Freeman? I or wonder if I Wait, why already do we for, all you know, have to wear these ridiculous ties. Okay, I can't open it. This is all within theoretical limits. I can't be bothered right now. Okay. Oh, okay, no, okay. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, so I guess we have to do something here. Yeah. Here we go. Now we can get in this. There we go. To the HEV Mark 4 protective system for use in hazardous environment conditions. High impact reactive armor activated. Atmospheric contaminant. Most of the sensor. simulation results are activated. Vital sign monitoring activated. Automatic medical systems engaged. Defensible. Okay, I need to turn I need to turn that volume up a little bit for the heavy suit. Munition level monitoring. Activated. Didn't do it. Communications interface online. Have a very safe day. 
Okay. So now we got the suit. Okay, I guess we go out of here now. I don't know where we're supposed to go now. Yeah, we came from there, so I think we have to go over here. <sighs> oh, sorry. Go right on through, sir. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Ah, it's good to see you. <laughs> it was like an eye scanner. I was like, what the heck are you doing? There we go. <laughs> Where is that's an actual dam? Probably. Biogenic safety crew. Report status at 1100, please. <laughs> Sorry. I'm kind of sick, I think. I'm getting kind of sick with you guys, so. I wanted to get a video out today. I mean, I got like a. My throat is like really sore and stuff. And yeah, I just not been feeling good recently. But yeah, I want I just want to get back into YouTube though. That I can make people happy and stuff. Do what I want to do. Just entertain people, that's what I want to do. Freeman, Gordon Freeman. Sorry, I'm on duty, Mr. Freeman. Probably everybody knows who I am. Ah, Gordon, here you are. We just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of gamble, but we need the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather they went to some lengths to get it. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Okay. I just want to see if I can put subtitles on real quick. Maybe a voice in the game, yes. I don't think so. So funny. Okay. Oh, it works. it's about to go critical. Uh oh. What the hell is going on with our equipment? It wasn't meant to do this in the first place. Hello. Hi. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedures today, Gordon. Yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And, potentially, the most unstable. Now, now, if you follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that, although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've yes, assured the administrator that nothing Thank will go wrong. Ah, uh, yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. And Okay, whoops. <laughs> okay. Where am I? Testing? Testing? <laughs> Everything. 
Everything seems to be in order. All right, Gordon. Your suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. If you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, we can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. Did I do it? Okay, it's been pretty fast. Oh my god, what is so what the <laughs> What? Oh whoa hi hi no That was scary Unforeseen consequences Oh Bud he, he's he's dead Oh, come on. Hey, dude. Dude. How did you survive? Now that people didn't. First aid. Holy! Oh my gosh, game. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not sure if we want to trust the elevator, but I guess we're going to have to. Okay, it worked. You guys okay? Why didn't they listen? We tried to warn them. I never thought I'd see a resonance cascade, let alone create one. Gordon, you're alive. Thank God for that hazard suit. I'm afraid to move him and all our phones are out. Please, get to the surface as soon as you can and let someone know we're stranded down here. You'll need me to activate the retinal scanners. I'm sure the rest of the science team will gladly help you. If they're alive. I oh, shoot. Um... Those are head crabs, I'm pretty sure. Oh, you're good. You're not gonna attack me? Oh, no, you're okay, you are. 
You just stay over there. Access denied. Oh, come on. I bet that guy has like a key card or something that I need. Well, there goes our grant money. Fine. You won't even know I'm here. Okay, you guys don't have the key card, right? Okay, you guys are stuck in there, so okay, you can't get me. Oh, oh, okay. Wait, no, come back. Fascinating. I never suspected such things could be. Holy poop. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, okay, okay, no, 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 no. Holy! Um, do we have like a weapon or something? Because I think we really need a weapon right now. Okay, okay. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to do that or so I'm supposed to attack that. This is okay, okay, okay. Run, run, run. Oh, okay, we got our crowbar now. Okay, um, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> okay, that's kind of what I thought. I mean, I was, that's not really what I thought. I was thinking. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh shoot. That was an accident. Okay. Oh, I knew the I knew this ladder was here for something. I was like, why is this ladder here whenever we come down earlier? What the heck is that? Science team uniform. Like as they used to be. Sound Ooh, one less horror in the world. Yeah, we might stand a better chance if we team up. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. Poor dude. Okay, I think we're near the science lab now, I think. Oh shoot. <laughs> Okay, I did not deserve to be playing this game. I'm gonna go look over here. Oh, that's blood. Of course, I had to be getting hungry now when I'm recording. Okay, um... I guess we have to head up here. Nobody knew I was gonna do that because it was it. Whatever. Okay, can't break that down. I guess. Anything. Get my health back. 
control. T2, sector C, immediately. <sighs> okay. Oh. There we go. Put some lights on, I guess, now. What are we supposed to do? Oh, uh, maybe actually, yeah, I was about to say, let's press in here. Oh, yeah, okay, we have to go from here. Oh, crap. Come on. Open the door, I'll help you. Oh. Cool. Well, um, I might be a freaking, like, um, alien or something. Aliens, maybe. Okay, this is scary. Oh. Dude, dude, are you alive? I was about to say, can I get you gone? Okay, you're dead, I think. I hope. Okay, so that's, that's how we switch. I guess that guy's not coming with us anymore, I can't go- I'm not completely sure what we're supposed to do right now. Confused. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Oh, it oh. oh, my gosh. Tastes good, buddy? Okay. I'm just gonna leave now. I don't wanna see you. Oh. What the? That was kind of real creepy. Save ammo I have. There's only two, but. Oh, 
Okay. <laughs> Okay guys, I think I'm going to leave this episode of Half-Life here. This game is actually really awesome so far. Yeah, this is actually a really awesome game so far. Um, I have one health, because uh, I, I didn't know what I was doing really, but... Yeah, these things are just freaky looking. So I guess a head, if a head crab goes on top of one of the scientists, it turns it into one of these things. Whatever they are. It's dead now. It's creepy though. But yeah, you guys, I'm playing this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. This game is awesome. And, um, yeah. I, um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.